So many meetings that I get into, people come in and all they do is bring their little bucket of garbage from their own area. They take it into the great big bucket, dump it in there, and for three or four days they stir it up. Oh, you wouldn't believe what's happening. You don't believe it's all down here. Down here right? And they get the little bucket and it goes out and smells just as bad as it did when, when they walked in. <laughs> Now, I know that's not true with you, but there's a lot of companies like that. And you literally have to look for good things. Now, when I started thinking about this, I said, you know, this is a great idea, but I, I wonder if it'll work at home. That's where I always I test everything out before I, I start it. So I said, all right, I'm going to try it. So one morning at breakfast, I told my family, I said, all right, tonight at the supper table, the first thing you're going to do is tell us something good that happened to you. So I went through the day. That night I came in, I started off, told something, my wife told something. Went to our daughter. <laughs> Rolled <the> out. <laughs> Nothing good happened to me today. And started to eat. I said, oh, no, no, you don't get to eat until you tell me something good. <laughs> she said, you didn't say that. <laughs> so she thought and thought and said, you know, I did get to go to recess today. I don't always get to go to recess. So that was a good thing. But here's the point. If she knows the next night at the supper table, what's the first thing I'm going to ask her is what good things happen to do. What does she look for throughout the day? Good things, exactly. Now, do bad things still happen to her? Sure they do. Now, bad things still happen to you. But the point is, if you're looking for and expecting good things, that's what you'll find, everybody. But so many people get up and grab the newspaper and listen to the news, and, oh, I don't know, I'm so depressed. <laughs> And the point is, after that, she would many times come around there and say, Oh, ask me, ask me, ask me. Let me tell you what good things happened to me today. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, when you can get your children to do that, you know you've done a great job as a parent. And so many times, if you just see them, what good things have happened to you today? And it's interesting, with the advent of Facebook and all that, we're, many of us, reconnecting with people from long ago. And I had a, a guy call me just two or three weeks ago that I knew in grade school. Haven't seen him since grade school. And the first thing I asked him was, so Mike, you know, I hadn't seen you since grade school. What good things were going on with you? He said, Patrick, I still see you're the same positive guy you were in grade school. Now, where that came from, I don't know. But I encourage you, as the leaders of the tourism business, you know, many times say, what good things are happening to you? Somebody walk in. Or start your meetings off with a good things report. Anytime you get together, what good thing, and you can say, what's the best thing that's happened to you here at work in the past week? But I encourage you to try it at your home also because it really does work. So a lot of people say, no, 